Ninja sees a squirrel and Ninja wants the squirrel. Right, Ninja? Right? Hello. Hey. Ding, ding. Hello. Aww. Good day. Uh, thank you very much for all the feedback you guys gave me uh, on the video I put up yesterday uh, with my new camera. So right now I'm just using my old Sony. But uh, one of the things I discovered while editing that video that even on the widest, this is uh, still a little bit too close. And so I just went online, watched a bunch of videos about the best lenses to use. And a lot of them said there's an 11 millimeter and uh, it's a great lens for vlogging. But this lens is still a great lens for crushing the background. There's also another lens. I think it's an F20, or sorry, um, I'm not sure what the the stop is on that camera, I mean, on the lens. It's a Sigma 22 millimeter fixed lens. And uh, it's, a, it's a bigger lens, but a lot of people say the best thing about that, I think it's an F1.4. And they said the best thing about that is even though it's a wide angle lens, it really crushes the background, which is how you get those really cool creative shots. So uh, we're gonna go into, oh, and then I told Carol I was gonna go into town and uh, look at a couple new lenses. And she's like, while you're there, grab some goulash soup because Carol loves uh, the goulash house's goulash soup. So we're gonna grab some goulash soup. And uh, also I'm thinking about returning this because it was like, um, it's basically an adapter that adapts all the regular uh, Canon lenses to this style of camera, the M50, but it was like 200 and something dollars and I don't think I'm going to be, yes, oh, sorry, it's $199.99. I don't think I need it. Uh, like the next lens I'm going to buy fits this and so is the other one. And I think between those three lenses, I don't need to put other lenses on it. So I can save $200 by returning this one and getting the 11, the 22 and possibly that 22. Cool. You guys ready? Let's go. <laughs> gentlemen let's get going shut that camera off oh let's go shop working today so uh, we're gonna go in there get those lenses and then we'll uh, play with the lenses and then we'll go and uh, get our goulash soup how much better that is look at that it's on my arm's length I can even get a little bit tighter if I want so the camera is not too far out in front of me not bad so this is the uh, so this I got this one used this was the 1122 and I saved like two hundred dollars so I returned I should shut take my mask off hang on All right, so mask off. Woo, always get uh, fogged up. So the lens I bought today 
is the uh, the EFM 1122, and it's a one. 0.4 to 5.6 has an image stabilizer in it and it was for like 350 instead of 500 and something uh, Canadian so that's probably the lens I'll be using mostly but I'm still gonna keep this one this is the one that came with the kit knowing what I know now I think I would like to have uh, possibly just bought the body and then bought this lens separately and if I had got that used I don't know if I would have saved money or not all right, let me shut this off. I'm super excited, people! And then this is the Sigma 16 mil 1.4. So it's gonna be better in low light and it's gonna crush the background, which is gonna be, just add to the whole B-roll that I'm trying to get into a little bit more. Let me just take out this lens, show you guys. We'll get to play with this lens. This thing of beauty. So it was funny, he, he uh, didn't think that this would fit on my camera, but again, the videos that I watched on the lenses that a lot of other people were talking about for vlogging and stuff, every one of them would get with this, put this camera or this lens right onto the camera and it worked perfectly. And then the guy in here was just a little confused as to, he thought for sure this needed an adapter to fit that camera, but it didn't. So luckily we tried it. It worked perfectly. I can't wait to do that. Actually, I, I think I think we'll go into Newmarket, downtown Newmarket, and uh, I'll probably put this lens on and uh, we'll have some fun. Let's go. Main Street Newmarket is right ahead of us. Got our new lens on there. I'm not gonna put the other one on because I don't have the the back cap for my other lens and I don't want a lens to sit there without a cap on it, a protective cap on the back. So I'm just gonna play with this lens for today and then we'll play with the other Sigma lens uh, when we get home maybe, or tomorrow. enjoyed that b-roll and I'm just standing in front of the goulash house and I'm hoping that they're open later hmm I'll have to look online because they might only be open at a certain time maybe four o'clock on Carol's obviously busy. She's gonna be mad. So I just called their phone and they're not open until the 29th. So they've closed down maybe because they're on holidays or something uh, or because of what's going on with the, uh, the modified uh, stage two thing here. So we'll have to come back on another day. Sorry, Carol. Well, I had a lot of fun uh, with this new setup today. Uh, let's go home and uh, maybe play with the Sigma for a little bit, just to show you what it's gonna be used for. Let's go home. Okay, made it back home. I've got the Sigma and I am, I've got the little Gorilla Pod and I am at full, 
arm's length, so this is not going to be um, a good lens for vlogging, but that's not what I bought it for. I bought it to uh, do close-ups and stuff, so check this out. Today was almost a three for three loss. Uh, there's the kitties. Where did Ninja go? He's a runner, man. Oh, there he is. He's over there. Um, so when I first walked into Henry's, uh, they didn't have the 20, the 11 to 22 lens, and then he thought this was the wrong lens. So I thought I wasn't going to get any lenses today. And then we figured out this one actually does fit the camera, which is the Sigma 22 millimeter. Uh, and then one of the other employees was walking around was listening to what we were talking about and he's like we have a used one and so he got the used one saved money returned the adapter i don't need which was 200 dollars uh and saved 200 dollars on a brand new uh, uh canon lens so all for all it was good except the fact that i didn't get carol's goulash so carol i, I, I phoned her and, and texted her and stuff and so she's like oh bummer so we'll have to do something special for Carol and uh, get her some goulash. Uh, they open on the 29th. I think I, I talked to you guys about it. Hey, Sonny. How you doing, kid? Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little uh, adventure vlog into um, Newmarket. Hope you enjoyed the new two new lenses. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, this is supposed to crush the background a little bit more, depending on how far back things are, depending on the lighting. Right now, I've got it on tracked. Um, autofocus so it's supposed to just track me yeah it's doing do my whole face and as I get closer the, the thing gets bigger that's cool ah I'm gonna get used to this camera I think I'm gonna enjoy vlogging with this camera and I think Sonny's gonna enjoy being outside a little bit longer so guys have a great day and we'll see you in the next vlog <laughs>